a lot of it was just picking up on what was being put down. Um, the writing in the novel is really specific about who she is, so I had a really wonderful resource to turn to there. The costumes that Hannah Bender put me in were really gave me a lot of insight into who she was. Uh, the way that Holly was written, which was Sophie Bender, uh, did a lot of no, writing with that. <laughs> it sounds a little intense. But she, she really developed Holly and the way that she talked, and it was very, like, the way that she rode through sentences was really particular and so all of that imagining through these resources on top of just trying to you know she's dealt a hand of also kind of unique um, traits she's on the spectrum and she has OCD and so I did a research of my own on top of that just to see how people um, cope with those um, with <laughs> those parts of their lives, I guess. So, so yeah, with those issues. So It's a very difficult thing to pull off because oftentimes when people try to perform or externalize OCD or being on the spectrum, it can yeah. come off as hokey, it can come off as funny, or it can come off as overly dramatic rather than just the way a person lives. Mm -hmm. And I think your performance is very, very subtle in the sense that you can notice these things, but it's not overwhelmed by tics and mannerisms. Thank you. Yeah. Well, the the relationships were really strong too. So I, I tried to like kind of focus on that, let that be the drive, like my, what was going on with Hodges or with Jerome or, and let the kind of like underlying things were just like kind of bubbling or living in me stay put throughout the whole time as well. So that makes me happy that you thought that. 